Jeff Glazier. I'm a Democrat, also running for city council. <coughs> I was born in Allentown. I've raised my family in Allentown. I have three sons, all of which have graduated from William Allen High and went on to college very, very well prepared. I run a business, my family business in Allentown, and as such, I'm committed to this town's success for everybody. And I found that the way to act on that is to be involved <coughs> in the city. Um, I served on the school board for 12 years prior to this, and I learned quite a bit there. And I would say the highlights of, of that experience was doing some of the financial research that showed how Allentown was not getting a fair deal from state funding. And eventually that led to the Rendell administration giving the school district about a 15% boost in funding so that all of our children could have books and could have art and could have all those things that we recognize as being important in a good, well-rounded education. I think the other highlight of my school district career was that I recognized that Allentown is a diverse community, and as such, the board needs to have diverse rep representation. And I actively supported and sought out diverse candidates. Really, Molina's here. He and I worked together many years ago. Cece Gerlach, I helped on her first uh, attempt at office. I worked with Joe Jackson on her various attempts. Uh, Deborah Lamb and Ellen Bishop. So that the board would begin to reflect the diversity that our city has. Um, I've been fortunate that I got appointed to Pete Schweier's uh, vacant seat on city council, and now I'm running for that in my own right. In my brief time on city council, uh, I'm proud of two things that I've done. One, um, there's an account in the city books called Account 46. It's the purchase services uh, account. The city never reported that in a timely manner, so it made it very hard for the public and city council to make accurate decisions and ask good questions at budget time. Um, I've sponsored the legislation that, that makes the act, account 46 information come out at the same time as the regular budget so that we have the time to delve into it and take a look at it. The second thing that I'm really proud of is with Candida, I serve on the Blighted Property Review Board. And since January, We've got 22 properties into the pipeline. These are properties <laughs> that are dragging down our neighborhood, and we're going to do our darndest to either get those landlords to fix those properties up or through the proper processes, and eventually eminent domain is take those properties and give them to somebody who can make them an asset to the neighborhood. So on, on the 19th, I ask for your support so I can continue my work to make Allentown a better place for everyone. Thank you.